guys, we're walking up to check the beaver trap, and we got a beaver. a little more right above these two push on that knife a little bit right there push it right down through there okay now go right across the top of his nose hold your knife like I showed you not like you're gonna stab somebody put a little pressure on it and pull There you go. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. Ouch! Cut oh, his nose off. Hold it up. Oh, no, hold it. No, hold it out. Hold first side out. First side out. What do I want to see? First side out, before? buddy. There you go. Why it's first beaver? <laughs> Hi guys, I'm fletching my first beaver. What are you doing now? Scraping the fat off. Put more of it up on your board and cover your stick on the site. And then once you get that area clean, just keep working around. You gotta turn it. So I'm using the sharp end of my knife to cut the meat off. You're going sideways too much. You have to push ahead more than you go sideways. Let your fur bump jump ahead of you. Okay? okay. Pull it back. So now Here. we're boarding and stretching the beaver. Why do you board it and stretch it? So it can dry out. Okay, bring that out to your same line. Just a third line out. Okay? Okay, now go in between each one of them on each side. Come down here. Oh, look at that. You didn't have it in the skin. You had it just on the edge of it. Then we will show you what the finished product looks like. Okay, so this is what the finished product looks like on the stretch and board. So you measure it there, and then you measure it there, and you add your numbers together, and that's what the, um, that's how big your beaver is. And... Um, I give all my credit to the Beaver God from Potter County, John Herman. Hi everybody, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you would like to support me, go to whyitoutdoors.com slash tip and you can leave a tip in my tip jar to help support me.